Pensuda? There you are. Thank you, Mr. Speaker, for giving me this opportunity. And I would like also to join in, in eulogizing the late CDF. And I want to say that there are many lessons learned truly, but there's no time. I want to say that in eulogizing the late Ogola, cultural practices or diversity is upheld in the Constitution. And if given chance to mourn, I think we have not yet fully concluded in mourning General Ogola. And when you see the region carrying on with mourning General Ogola, know that it is constitutionally upheld in the Constitution. Number two, I want to say that this House must learn that when ad hoc committees or any committee of inquiry is formed to provide for a report, and I'm talking from the perspective of what the President said, that he is going to make sure that truth and nothing but the truth is given and provided. Your time is up, Order Ben Suda. Your time is up, KJ. Mr. Speaker, I thank you. I had the honor and privilege to meet General Ogola and his family. And Mr. Speaker, what a fine gentleman and what a big loss for this country.